Hello, it's Guy here from GD Models. Today I'm going to be doing the next stage of the Yamato. I told you that stage wouldn't take long. What was it? Two days? Three days? Um, since the last build, which was steps 31, 32, 33, 34 and 35, um, she's only taped on at the moment because they said just to sell the taper on but as you can see I've done the deck planking from here all the way to here still got that much to do um, and also I'll show you the other little bits and pieces I've built but it wasn't actually too much of these five, episodes, five issues uh, these here these little guns here As you can see, tiny little guns, and the ones with them I've got. I'll show you. I just got them all out. I just chuck them on the pile. As you can quite rightly see, there's quite a few of them that I've had to make up. These are the anti-aircraft guns for this battleship. So there you go, you've got that many little guns I've made up. All ready to go on her. Um, they'll dry as well, so I'll do that. The decking's done. As I said, I've just got to put my gloves on quick. Yeah, the decking's done. Um, so today... I will be doing the um, video for 30s, sorry, yeah, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40. Um, I've also looked, I got all my bits out last night from the box. Um, and put them all in number order and everything because they're all just jumbled up initially and um, there's 90 parts so 40 I'm just still under halfway uh, but in the next couple of days I should be about halfway um, there you go sorry about that so yeah so that's the Yamato so far also I do apologise I haven't done any of the Santa Maria yet but um, I've been really busy with the uh, Yamato. I've been trying to crack that out, really, before I get too hooked into the Santa Maria. Because this one has been going on since um, about Christmas. So here's the next five issues. As you can see, lots and lots of uh, decking as before. I am going to quickly... Um, show you these. This is issues 36. Uh, uh, you can, I don't know if I mentioned, you could pay for these at mod, on model space um, in two different ways. You can either do it over... 24 month uh, which is cheap I think it's about 30 or 12 month for 60 I did 12 month um, so it's a very expensive model uh, so first off you've got some more wires that will be for more of these little guns the same as the ones I've got over there I think there's what four more in there so that should be fun <laughs> Got, I've been building so many of those little guns. You've got here some more planks. Um, that one's a bit broken, but it doesn't matter. It's got, I've got loads of them. And you've got the final part of the Yamato deck. As you can see, this is where the um, aircraft go. I wonder if that's... Yeah, that's slightly ingrained. Uh, so you've got the runways... Here, the little catapult runway things, and here you've got um, where the back gun's going to sit. 
So that's that, and you've got two guns sitting here and here. No, the cranes sit here and here, sorry. Right, issue's 37. As I said, I'm really flying through the Yamato at the moment, so I'll most probably do this step in the next couple of days as well, and then do another one. Um, as I said, I'm holding off on the Santa Maria just for the moment until I get more of this done and then I can crack on with the Santa Maria when this is towards the end because there's so much to do in one of these kits that I was a bit stupid trying to do two of them at once these wooden ones right so here you've got another rod this is for um, the same again I think you've got in here some bigger guns and a couple of smaller ones so you've got a couple of smaller ones in there and you've got some quite heavy maintenance ones, heavy duty uh, guns there with bigger randles and the smaller randles as well. So that's that issue with obviously some more planking and that's, where was it, 39, 30. It'll be that one, 38. Stickers come off, but that's 38, definitely. Right, 30, 30, 38, sorry, is more planks. So I've got a lot more planking to do. <laughs> it's not too bad, it's just a bit... The planking's easy going, but it gets very boring because you're there and it's like... You have to draw the lines on the deck uh, every... 50 millimetre apart or 5 centimetre apart then um, once you've done that the, and do the lines then you have to cut these into a hundred, uh, 10 centimetre apart so you get 3 out of each one and it asks you to do like 90 in that so you're there just cutting like these into 90 separate bits and then you have to then lay them out and it's it's a bit boring to be fair, but uh, he'll get there. Okay, so in this bag we've got more of those guns here. I think that's to do with the gun as well. And some big round thingies, these are for the guns as well. So there are more guns. The ship was heavily armoured, heavily armoured. I think if I remember rightly, she was the most armoured battle, most armoured battleship of all time, and biggest. It was actually bigger than the Bismarck. Um, so she was a monster. She was a Yamato class, if I remember rightly, and there was a couple of them they made. Right here, you've got uh, more guns. And more of those big heavy duty guns it looks like in there. So there's quite a few in there. And more decking. But I think these are the actual, this issue here that I'm about to show you, this is numbers 40. This is actually the last decking for the whole ship. Because I, as I said I looked in all the bags yesterday and these were the last um, ones for decking. So, at the end of this stage, I have the decking all finished, which I'll be grateful about. So, more decking. There's quite a bit there, loads of decking there to get on with. And... I've got some other peculiar pieces in here, so sli something slightly different. You've got two slightly different. These are ra these are radar, I think. Spotters or whatever they're called, or flashlights. So they're, some, they're not guns. And we've got a couple smaller rods. Same um, size. Got a tiny little rod there as well. Another bit, um, slightly thicker than that, than the deck, and so that's something completely different. And you got these bits. 
I've looked as well slightly forward these bits are for um, when this goes on the slats go underneath these side bits so that's it that's the next five steps so that'll keep me busy and um, been looking as well I just do a quick preview as it's out in a Oh, and I forgot to put it away yesterday. The one everyone most probably is waiting for is the propellers. It's 53, so I'm getting close. And there are the propellers there, so. And then I can finally spray up the hull after they're in. But that's 53, so it's another about, what, just under 10 issues time. So, if I'm cracking these out once every about three days at the moment, it should be end of next week I should be on them hopefully um, I don't normally like to plan because it's so I just take my time but the speed I'm going at the moment it'll be sometime next week uh, other than that I hope you've enjoyed this bit um, preview of the next five steps I do once again apologize for the Yamato uh, not the Yamato the Santa Maria I'll show you I have been doing it slowly very slowly you got some of the deck planks on, not deck planks, um, first planking on, and they're drying with the pins in. And I'll, I do a couple of planks like when the Yamato's drying. So I'm doing it slowly, but I'll bring you the next video when the uh, first lot of planking is finished. Uh, so it could be any time up from a week, week and a half, but. As I said, that's why I'm taking my time on that. So, as always, thank you for watching my video. And uh, don't forget, you're more than welcome to go over to my Facebook page where you can uh, share your builds. Um, or you can... F I do more photos on there as well. So there's always um, more things I do on there. And other than that, thank you. Have a great day and happy modelling. Goodbye for now.